Hi guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about Stellar Lumens XLM. I recently posted a video about it. Uh, please click on that video to find out what Stellar Lumens is and what their projects are and my price prediction for the future. Uh, but today I'm going to talk, be more realistic about the price prediction and also will be doing uh, the technicals in the end. So just stick with me for a while. Um, also guys, um, if you guys like my content, please subscribe my channel to show your support and smash that like button so uh, I've been going through a lot of YouTube videos recently about Stellar Lumens and also Reddit posts and people were talking about uh, you know $1,000, $2,000, $10,000, $20,000 in the future and in my mind I'm like are you guys doing this for views and like or you think that's where the price is gonna be in five years um, if you think that's where it will be just because of Bitcoin's um, rally or uh, or because of the price that you're seeing Bitcoin is at right now, then you'll have to check the market cap of Bitcoin. Bitcoin is at $1 trillion market cap. Um, and Ethereum is, is it at around 300 plus billion market cap. Uh, you know, I think there are only a couple of companies uh, that are ahead of Bitcoin uh, right now in terms of market cap. That is at Apple, Amazon, and I think it's it's Google. Um, you can just do your research and uh, drop a comment down below if I'm wrong. Uh, and now let's uh, check where we are at in terms of the market cap. We are at 11.3 billion dollar market cap and uh, the price is trading at um, let's say 50 cents you know 0 0.49 cents to 50 cents and uh, to be more realistic just to hit the one dollar uh, we'll have to do times two the market cap right now that will be around 23 uh, billion dollars right and uh, if you want it to hit 2.50 dollar uh, then um, then the market cap should be at around 55 to 57 dollars if we want it to be at five dollars then around 510 to 20 billion and ten dollars would be 220 uh, billions to 230 between that and for 25 550 billion that is more than ethereum's market cap right now for 50 maybe like one trillion and plus uh, so I, I understand that uh, the market cap right now is not that big comparing to the oldest cryptocurrency, I mean, <laughs> if you want to compare it to Bitcoin, but you know, it's, let's just be more realistic here. Um, I believe in this project, you know, it's, it's a hidden gem, but hitting $2,000 or $3,000 or even $5,000 in the future, I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't see it happening. Uh, again, guys, I'm not, I'm not a hitter. Uh, I'm just a believer, and I like to be more realistic about it. Um, my prediction is, you know, around two to five dollars, and that is if we are lucky. Maybe in five years, if everything goes well in the crypto world, uh, you know, with all the regulations, control, and adaptation, uh, maybe we'll hit the double digit. Um, but uh, triple does it um, in three to four years? Uh, hmm. I, I don't know. I don't know. Um, I wanted to hit triple does it. Yeah, sure. That would make me a multimillionaire, but uh, uh, I don't think if it's going to be um, that easy. Um, and if you are looking to be a millionaire within a couple of months, you know, to go through that uh, Dogecoin rally, um, then um, I'm, I'm sorry to disappoint you guys. Um, I don't think if it's if it's going to um, be in a couple of months. Uh, I understand the fundamentals of the company. Uh, it's strong, uh, but it's a long term game. I don't see it playing for a short term. Maybe like you, you might want to swing it for a while. You you can make a couple of hundred of thousands of dollars. Um, but I don't think um, it's going to make you a millionaire investing like two or three thousand dollars in a couple of in a couple of months. Um, but again, after AMC, GM, and Dogecoin, I think anything can have value in the market, and anything is possible. You just need uh, millions of people behind it and some marketing strategies. Maybe like posting um a you know a marketing board in front of um you know. Um, 
Times Square or any gas station, maybe like we might attract um, uh, more investors. Uh, but again, even if we do so, um, uh, triple digit is not possible. That's what I think um, right now. Um, I did also talk about uh, SPY in my previous video, um, and I would like to connect that to Bitcoin again. Uh, because for uh, Stellar Lumens to do well in the market, Bitcoin will have to survive and they will have to do well uh, so that we can target more banking sectors and like attract more people towards it. But again, Bitcoin will have to do well. Okay, uh, so let's talk about um, the chart and technicals right now. Um, so last time we broke um, this uh, resistance level, but it was a uh, you know fake breakout that last long, and it was a pullback uh, during the crypto dump week that happened, and right now it's still trying to recover from that phase. Uh, just watch for this breakout right here. That's what I would say. Uh, watch for uh, you know 50 cents. We've been in this area for weeks now, and if it if we manage to go above this uh, and hold this line and uh, up to 0. Uh, you know 50 cents, uh, I think it can hit uh, 60 to 65 cents. That would be my price target in a couple of weeks, but we'll have to make this our uh, new support. Um, so guys, uh, that is it for today's uh, episode. Uh, just comment down below and let me know where you think XLM will be in the future, your price prediction, um, and let me know if I'm uh, wrong. Um, anyways, um, I will see you in another crypto episode. Until then, peace.